The overall goal of this protocol for real-time quaking-induced conversion assay is to allow sensitive detection of chronic wasting disease prions in cervid fecal samples. This method can help answer key questions in the CWD research field, such as when are infected cervids shedding CWD prions in feces. The main advantage of this technique is that it is specific, sensitive, and it enables high throughput of samples. Demonstrating the procedure will be Chini Cheng, a lab technician from my laboratory. To begin this procedure, add 1 gram of fecal material to a tube containing 10 milliliters feces extract buffer. Using a dissociator with a preset program for proteins, homogenize the fecal pellets for one minute at room temperature. Repeat this two to three times until the fecal samples are completely homogenized. Then use parafilm to seal the tubes and place them onto a rocking platform or rotary shaker for a one hour incubation at room temperature. After this, centrifuge at 18,000 G's for 5 minutes at room temperature. Collect the supernatants and aliquot them into 1.5 milliliter tubes. Store at minus 80 degrees Celsius until ready to use. To begin the sodium phosphatungstic acid precipitation method, add 250 microliters of sarcosal to 1 milliliter of